Hi guys, I am back with another update. It has been a long time and a whole lot has happened. Alright, I'm going to try to get y'all a fast version because it's a lot of shit. One, it's a lot of shit, but I'm going to do it without like spoiling it for y'all because boot camp was really an experience. Um, and I wouldn't want to like uh, spoil the spirit of it. So... Let's see, y'all know I shipped March 12th, and I graduated May 4th. Today is May 15th, so I've been out for about 11 days. Um, let's see, boot camp. Upon arrival, immediately it snapped into the whole boot camp, like, in your face thing. Like, um, but it was not as bad. Like, the entire experience was nowhere near as bad as I expected it to be. Like, I expected it to be like 24 7. It was not like that. Um, we did get beat a lot. <laughs> um, but that's to be expected. I mean, you gotta learn the basics first. Um, we would get beat for making mistakes or not following directions or not paying attention. So, if I could give any advice, it would be to pay uh, attention. If they say do 1, 2, 2.7, then 3, don't do 1, 2, 2.5, then 3, if you can, like, get that. Um, pay attention to detail. That's the whole, that's, like, the Navy's whole thing. Because they do so much in, like, the daily operation, especially on ships and stuff. It's like, if one person missed one detail, everybody could be fucked. So, um... That's their whole thing. Pay attention to detail. Uh, let's see. Um, as far as jobs and boot camp, my division, um, like the males, it was an integrated division, of course. I'm a female. Ha. Ah, yeah. So when I got there, the males had already been there for a while before. We did for like a week, week and a half, something like that. So um, a lot of the positions were already given to them when we got there. So we kind of got the short end of the deal short end of the stick, but, um, I would recommend, um, going for a position, even though, they, like, you can't even ask for a job in boot camp, they look, and they say, I want you, you, and you, like, they just randomly pick it, so, um, but if you can, like, um, don't, like, fade into the background, don't be quiet and stuff, like, I know this glare is probably fucking me up, but, um, you know, don't fade into the background, don't be so quiet and so scared and timid, um, because then they overlook you, uh, try to get a job. Our POC is like the leader of the division, especially when marching, um, because you march everywhere you go, and, um, they call the calls, like, tell you which way to turn. Um, A-Rock calls the cadence left, 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 right, left, or stinks, whatever cadence that y'all march into, so everybody can be on the same foot. Um, I was PFC. I, so it's two people that lead the division, like, physically when marching, like, with the two people in the front. So it's Guidon and it's PFC. Guidon is the shit because without him there's nothing. But then there's me, PFC. So um, they uh, looked at who marched and whoever can march the best. Uh, I, why am I not looking in the camera? I'm talking to y'all. They fucking um, looked at who was marching and seeing who could march the best. And then um, whoever marched the best, they made them fucking Guidon and PFC. I guess I, I don't fucking know. But anyways, um, so graduation, I was like smack dab in the front. That was live. Um, two things that's going to save your ass in boot camp that they did not tell us until, like, the middle, which um, I don't feel bad for telling y'all this, which one thing is belay my last. Belay my last means erase what the fuck I just said and I'm going to start over. Like, ugh, belay my last. If you say something, if you call a chief a petty officer or a petty officer a chief or... You say something fucked up or you, my bad, don't say my bad. Don't be like, I, 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 say, belay my last and say what you really meant to say. <laughs> like that shit got us beat so many times, us not knowing what to say or saying the wrong thing and not knowing to say belay my last. So, belay my last and my apologies. Like, our RDCs, RDCs is recruit division commanders. So, to the civilian world, they would be, Drill sergeant. Yes, drill sergeant. Our RDCs hated for us to say I'm sorry because 
they're like sailors aren't sorry and blah 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 and so on and so forth so when you make a mistake don't say I'm sorry say my apologies if you do something wrong to them or whatever and normally when you say I'm sorry say my apologies because whenever we would say I'm sorry they'd be like oh yeah I know I'm sorry I know I'm a sorry petty officer yeah I know I'm sorry something 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 this that, and that they're like they would get just like take you overboard um, so yeah, belay my last and my apologies. What else? Uh, fucking, uh, um, try to be quick. We took, like, when we first started, when we, when we first got there, like, they would give us, like, six minutes for hygiene, which is to take a shower. You only get one shower a day. So, for females, we got one shower a day, and it was, like, six minutes. Then, after a while, it was, like, four minutes. I don't know what happened, but... Be fast, hit your hot spots, and keep it moving. So, yeah, you going to pretty much be doing that for two months. Um, what else? Uh, child, you get three meals a day. It's called child. Um, no talking in the P-way, in the hallway, passageway. No talking. Uh, what else? I already know I'm going to end up having to do a, an, a, an additional video to this because... I'm just like spread a moment like twerking it. I just got my laptop. People was rushing me. <clears throat> I'm not going to say no names. But um what else? Ah, oh, fuck. Um like the first week, P week is the hardest week. That was my hardest week because it's new, you adapting, you get shots. I went there and I got fucking seven shots, I think. Seven shots the first time. And then when you almost up about to graduate, you go back and you get more shots. I think I got like three or four shots. I think I got three shots the last time. And I got a shot in the ass. That shit, everybody made it seem like it was going to be like a bazooka going off in your ass. But it was not that bad. Like, it really wasn't that bad. I guess because everybody hyped it up so much. Um, now I'm in A school. Um, one day I'll give y'all a tour of my room when it's clean and all that. It's supposed to be clean all the time, but I just got here, there's so much shit to do. I don't be having time for all that. It's 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 all right. It's good. It's it's not good, good. It's not excellent. It's not outstanding. I got excellent with my room inspection though, so that lets y'all know. Um my roommate is cool as fuck. Um the girls that I came in with are not so lucky. Like they got hoes and fucking slubs and all of that for roommates. Um Let's see. What else? I don't know. Um, if you have questions or anything, uh, you could shoot me a message or tweet me. I'm Judy Got Juice. For now, I don't know. I might change it, but for now, I'm Judy Got Juice. And yeah. Um. Yeah. Just remember, belay my last and fucking my apologies, cause that shit was not right. Um, stay humble. Don't show attitude because when you're talking to them, they want you to look past them, not at them. They take it as disrespect if you look at them, like in their eyes. So look past them. My RDC's called it a thousand yards there. So you're looking, standing at attention, looking past them. They in your face no matter what they're doing. Because I pretty often used to always do this. And yeah, it's like make you, you would look at the hand, right? No, don't look at the hand. Look past them at all times. Um, you'll know when it's okay to look at them, but for the first week, do not fucking look at them in their eyes. <laughs> for like the first couple weeks, don't do it. You will get fucked up. Um, don't give up. When y'all getting IT, IT is, I think, intense training. Yeah, that's what it's there for. Intense training. When y'all getting IT, just do that shit. It's exercise. Enjoy that shit. You're going to have a banging body when you get out. Just do it. Don't fucking quit. Don't give up. Don't stop. Don't fall on the, on the deck acting crazy, falling out, <laughs> I can't breathe and all that extra shit because they will fucking target you every time. It was so many fucking weaklings in there that got targeted every time because they fucking couldn't keep up. Um, what else? The end of my shit was supposed to be like fucking five minutes ago. Um... Oh, yeah, I, yeah. when they're in your face and they saying shit, they're going to be talking shit like, if, yeah, you think you come from here, la, 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 just keep your face straight. Don't be sitting there making faces like, looking past them, making faces like, 
No, don't do that. They will fuck you up. They be like, drop, drop. My fucking chief, holy cow. He was freaking hilarious. Like, oh my god. He be like, think of position, get there. Think of position is push up position. And you would think that that shit wouldn't hurt. But just sitting there like that in a push up position, like not doing push ups, but just sitting there, fucking out of control. Um, I might do another video showing y'all the um the exercises that we did that we did do for IT, just so y'all could probably do them and get prepared. But we did, if you want to do like some independent research, um, we did eight count bodybuilders, mountain climbers, jumping jacks, push ups, sit ups, um. That was pretty much it. Like, at the end, they started throwing, like, more advanced workouts in there, like, more advanced exercises. But that was actually for in-house PT, not for IT. Yeah, the eight counts, bodybuilders, jumping jacks. I hated jumping jacks. Like, I would rather do anything in the world. I would shovel shit before I fucking do jumping jacks. I hate that shit. Like, fuck no. Fuck no. I hate that shit. Um, yeah, look up eight counts and fucking mountain climbers because you're going to do a shit ton of them um oh yeah they wake you up in the morning it, it'll it'll fucking be a um shit over the intercom be like reveille reveille something 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 talking shit like a whole bunch of shit they saying and then your RDCs are coming in get up get up get out of your racks get out of your racks get on the tow line the tow line is this fucking line that goes around the room it's an invisible line um yeah, you'll have to basically stand in front of your rack, like, like, yeah. That shit was not right. So, if you can, try to get up before they wake you up, because that shit will fuck you a whole day up. Like, you'll be fucked up all day. <laughs> because you didn't got woke up, like, by somebody yelling at your shit. Um, yeah, that's all I got so far. Well, for now, that's all I got. Um, any more questions, like, specifics about whatever... You can fucking, uh, oh yeah, you already know I cuss like a sailor, so whatever. And I am a sailor now. Woohoo! So, um, yeah, any questions, comments, whatever, inbox me, tweet me, fucking all that good shit. Um, yeah, do your thing. And I hope I am, or was, am, will be helped to future sailors because honestly, watching people's videos before I went in helped me because. It's like, it's a lot easier to deal with when you have an idea of what to expect as opposed to just going into it 100% blind. Like I said, it's a, it's a shit ton of shit that I didn't tell y'all because I want y'all to experience it for yourself. And it's not like I'm trying to fuck y'all over or like, ooh, sh sh it's, it's just like the beauty of it. Because boot camp really was a beautiful thing, at least for me. Like, I had fun. And I learned a lot. I learned a shit ton. And I just wouldn't want to spoil that for y'all. But um, as far as, like, the fear factor and the shock factor, like, just relax. Like, it's going to be home for two months. Try try to make it as easy as possible for yourself. Um, try to be a team player from the jump. I know it's going to be hard, especially if you're in, um, a female. It's going to be hard because it's a bunch of other fucking females. I need to make a video of that by its fucking self because living with 80 females... O-M-F-G. That's all I'm saying. But yeah, tweet me, message me. I'm out.